leader of biotechnology program at the International Institute of Tropical Agriculture, Dr. Lina Tripathi, says extreme hunger will hit Africa by 2050 if agricultural productivity is not doubled. Already about 208 million people on the continent face starvation, for which reason she is advocating the rapid adoption of biotechnology, particularly genome editing for crop improvement to solve the threat of food insecurity on the continent. Dr. Thripati was addressing the West Africa Center for Crop Improvement Forum in Accra on transforming Africa's agriculture using biotech. Statistics from the United Nations show that about 208 million people in Africa are facing starvation, representing about 20.2% of the population on the continent. This means Africa needs the necessary tools to increase agricultural productivity to reduce hunger on the continent through biotechnology. Transforming Africa's agriculture using biotechnology is the focus of the West Africa Center for Crop Improvement Conference on Biotech Agriculture. Biotechnology is an innovative approach to deal with the continent's threat of hunger. Genetic modification, according to the crop breeders at the International Symposium, holds a lot of benefits for Africa to attain food security and ward of hunger. Experts say plant genome editing has become an important molecular tool to revolutionize modern breeding of crops and scaling it up into agriculture will help the continent deal with food insecurity. A deputy minister for food and agriculture said the Ministry of Food and Agriculture will adopt this technology to increase productivity. There is evidence that biotechnology can help improve the lives of farmers. Africa certainly has to do more so the continent can benefit better from agriculture, biotechnology and other scientific innovations. The government of Ghana will continue to make more investments in transforming agricultural production through science and technology for the benefit of the population, including women and children. Leader of the biotechnology program at the International Institute of Tropical Agriculture, Dr. Lina Chapathi, says global population is increasing, especially in Africa, which means agriculture productivity must similarly be increased. In order to do so, we have to like utilize all the, uh, all the tools available to us, including the new breeding tools in complementation with the traditional tools to increase the agriculture production that will help um, uh, for food security and also um, um, minimizing mal malnutrition and the poverty elevation. Discussions at the West Africa Center for Crop Improvement International Symposium were on the future of agriculture transformation and biotech crops in Africa.